In this video, we'll be using a Cisco 3560 CG switch, and the commands we'll be learning how to use will be show MAC address table and show ARP. This quick little demonstration will show you how to determine the IP address of a device connected to a specific port on a Cisco switch. So first off, let's look at the port we're going to look at, and that will, port will be the second gigabit interface on this switch. If you go here we look at it we can tell that the device is up, the protocol is up, the address um, for that specific interface shows it right there. And there's some other bit of information you'll have the output, the input on it. Not a lot going on with this specific switch because it's in a demo environment. But uh, what we can do is we can look at the Mac address table by typing in this command here and then telling the command exactly what interface we want to look at. So if we go like that we can see that the interface that's, or the, I, the MAC address that's being learned off of that interface is this MAC address right here. So if we copy this and save this just so we can have this for a further reference what we can do is on the switch itself we can look at the ARP table and we can just do a show ARP now this switch again since it's a demo environment does there's not really a whole lot to look at but if you're looking at a core that has you know possibly hundreds of interfaces on it the list would be quite long and it might take a while to find that specific MAC address here we found it almost immediately it's this one right here and we can see that the IP address is this IP address right here now if you were in an environment that you had a core that you had to look at hundreds of ports on you might want to further uh, refine your ARP command to include the specific MAC address that you're looking for. So if we go here and we look at the MAC address that we wanted, it's this one right here. So if we copy this, type in this command show ARP, and then we put in a pipe space and then include, and then we can paste in the MAC address that we're looking for, and then we'll just bring them back as a result just that specific MAC address that we're looking for and we can see that this is the IP address that we want this is the VLAN and it's on so just a quick little tip hope you find that useful thanks